Indoors, outdoors, East Coast, West Coast, World Cup, Nations Cup, Pony Finals, Big Egg Finals, Spring, Summer, Winter, Fall, Shona has got it all. From Florida to California, you can find Shona just about anywhere, bringing you live streaming results and analysis from the country's biggest horse shows. We know you can't keep up with everything, but you know we've got you covered. All the latest horse show highlights are right here. It's the Shonet Weekly Wrap. 2017 brought about many firsts for Shonet and the athletes we broadcasted. From Devon to Del Mar, Shonet captured some of the greatest moments of the year with more to come in the next 12 months. Happy New Year and thank you for your loyalty to Shonet. Here are some of our favorite moments of 2017. So you want to win a million dollars? Shonet streamed all of the HITS $1 million Grand Prix classes, including at Saugerties, while Andre Tima and Contendrix had to work hardest for their win. They were the only pair to keep the jumps up and won with a single time fault. The eight-year-old gelding Eddie Blue was a breakout equine star in 2017. The Gray was a winner at the American Gold Cup with his rider Devin Ryan, but his first big win of the year came in the Great American Insurance Group Grand Prix. Brightland was BZ Madden's breakout mount of 2017. The duo won many events and hinted at success to come for the rest of the year when they won the Old Salem Farm Grand Prix in the spring. Shonet was back at the Great Lakes Equestrian Festival this summer where we set up camp for six glorious weeks of jumping on the lake. Shane Sweetnam rode his veteran Mount Cyclone to the win in the opening week's Meyer Grand Prix. Warning, some flowers may have been harmed in the making of this film. Shonet spent more time on the West Coast than ever in 2017 in our first trip to where the surf meets the turf, Andy Coker and Navallo de Poetone stole the show when winning the Longines FEI World Cup jumping Del Mar. There are few venues quite like the beautiful Deer Ridge Farms in Wellington. Niall Nassar won the Longines FEI World Cup jumping Palm Beach at the Palm Beach Masters with his World Cup final veteran, Lord Dan. It was a picturesque setting. Daniel Blumen jumped in three international classes of the 2017 Hampton Classic. He won all three of them. That included the feature event, the four-star Hampton Classic Grand Prix with Ladriano Z. Shonet bid a fond farewell to one of its all-time favorites in D.C. this year. McLean Ward's reliable, ultra-game, ultra-fast mount Double H Carlos Z was retired following his win in the International Jumper Speed Final. It was a fitting end to an illustrious career that saw the gelding win 29 FEI classes around the globe. Shonet captured many of those wins on camera. It's unlike anything else on Shonet's schedule. The USCF Pony Finals didn't disappoint in 2017. Junior rider Augusta Iwasaki shone brightest. She piloted the 12-year-old medium Welsh pony Newsflash to the coveted grand champion Hunter Pony title. McLean Ward was about to win the 2016 Sapphire Grand Prix of Devon when his Mount Rothschild uncharacteristically spooked and ran out at the final fence of the jump off. In 2017, Ward and Rothschild got their revenge. Ward has now won the prestigious Grand Prix, named after another famous mount in Sapphire, a remarkable nine times, twice with Rothschild. In the sport of show jumping, it's anyone's guess who will step up as the stars of 2018. But we can promise you, Shonet will be there to capture every moment.